Fun fact, that noise and the heartbeat, well, that's pretty much it. It's supposed to represent a heartbeat, so. It's a little colder today. It's gray outside, it's still gray. I'm surprised, I figured it would look a little nicer. So I don't know what the weather is gonna be today, but I am gonna turn the fan a little bit up. Anyway, good morning. It's Monday, I guess I'm feeling a little livelier today. Usually Mondays, um, I'm dead in the water, but um, yeah, the weekend's over once again. And as usual, Lord willingly, the week will go by faster than, than I'll know. Next thing you know, it'll be Wednesday. Oh, that's a nice BMW. <laughs> I like those BMWs where they had the, the, the white. And then obviously, I think, no. So there's those uh, grills or whatever those two. Um, you know, the BMW, you can tell a BMW. And some of the cars, they're not black. They'll have like red, red stripes and blue stripes. Those are super fine. I ain't even gonna lie. Those are like some of the finest colors on a car I've ever seen. Anyway, I took Jim to work this morning and I managed to get an hour and a half of sleep. But I woke up at eight. My mom woke me up at eight. So this time she knew I kind of got out the door, but I wasn't even in the bathroom that long, so that's the crazy thing. I still ended up leaving by nine. It's 8.58, and I, I explained to her, I was like, she was like, you better get out the door, dude. I'm like, I'm trying to, you know? The hard part of every morning that really takes a good amount of time at the end of the day is finding food. That's always the fucking challenge in the morning, is finding food to eat in the morning. I don't know if I should, wake up in the morning eat cereal before I get in the shower or or what you know so then I have something in my system because at the last minute I I can never seem to have enough time to eat a bowl of cereal so I'm, I'm pretty dead in the water on that one but anyway uh, I haven't really been doing much lately I feel kind of stupid for not well then again my shooting videos don't really get much attention either so I don't I don't really know, but anyway, today is July 15th, so uh, throughout the week, I guess one of the ladies from Heather, Heather's, died of cancer yesterday, or within the last couple days, uh, Shannon Doherty, I think that's her name, you know, I knew I recognized that name, I was like, what's that name from, where do I recognize that name from, you know, so... So it totally, um, you know, swing on by, I'm on the wrong lane, that's mainly why. Oh, hold on, buddy, let me get in front of you. Right. So like I was saying, um, yeah, you know, uh, Shannon Doherty, I knew I recognized that name from somewhere, I was like, where the fuck do I know that name from? But yeah, she was on Heather's, Heather's was a cool movie, it wasn't that bad. But yeah, so rest in peace. And then Richard Simmons, good old Richard Simmons. Yeah. I'm a pony, I'm a pony, I'm a pony. <laughs> that's where I recognize him from. I don't know what movie that's from, but in, there's a movie. He was also on Space Jam as well. But yeah, he, he was a workout guy. But yeah, I don't know. I don't think it was actually him, though, that was saying... I'm a pony, I'm a pony, I'm a pony, I'm a pony. I fucking don't remember where that came from, though. It's too bad, I gotta look it up. But, yeah, my dad knows where that's from. He was the one who told me about it. He, he would. He likes to to say some movie lines sometimes out of nowhere. And it's pretty damn funny. And, and one of those lines I remember was, I'm a pony, I'm a pony. And, you know, I, I, I don't think it was actually Richard Simmons, but I think somebody was just parodying him. Not sure, but Richard Simmons always said some weird shit like that. But you know, it worked. It, it made it funny, I guess. But then again, I've never really watched the guy. But everybody knows who Richard Simmons is. So yeah, rest in peace. And then Shelley Duvall also died. You know, sometime last week. Rest in peace. So yeah, the weekend. Um, it was chill. Honestly, yesterday was the longest I played a video game in a long time. 
I have not played on the Xbox for fucking nine hours straight yesterday. I was playing this game. So, I'm going to be real. I made a video on this yesterday, but I deleted it, so I'm going to do it again. I don't like anime games. I really, really don't like anime games. I've tried a few. I've tried the Naruto fighting games. I've tried the Sword Art Online shooting games. I I just don't like those games. Uh, and, and Dragon Ball, I just don't care for them. And again, I don't, I'm not bashing anybody who likes that shit. But there are some exceptions. There are some exceptions that I genuinely thought was fun. But none of them are actually anime shows. They're, they're actually original video games. One of them got an actual adaption of an anime, but the other, the other one did not. And I thought these games were boring as fuck growing up. Uh, well, not the first one that I played. The second one, which I was playing all day yesterday, I've had for a long time, but it just looked hella boring. But I, I've been finally playing it, and I've been I've been grinding on it a bit, and it's really not that bad. It's, you know, I don't know. Kind of takes, takes the mind away from violent video games for a good minute, I suppose. So, uh, the Phoenix Wright games, the, the, the Phoenix Wright games, uh, it really, it wasn't that bad. It, it lo made me look weird considering my mom walked in on me. <laughs> and you know how parents are with the, that type of shit. I was like, this game is not weird at all. It's really not. You play as an attorney and you have to basically help people not get uh, the guilty verdict, you know. But actual innocent people. Because the killers always end up fucking testifying, you know, or somebody who's in, who's connected to the killer, you know, as a, a, an accomplice, I guess, you know, so, so, but yeah, I, I beat the first game, there's like five, five level, five stories, you know, there, I, I beat the very first one, the very first day I installed it months ago, it was, uh, I don't fucking remember. Some guy with a, a toupee or whatever it's called. And, yeah, he, he had a, uh, had it out for a model. And pretty much he thought he was slick by testifying in court. You know, and uh, blaming this character called Larry Butts. Yeah, so, yeah, he's a pretty big character. But, yeah, you're, you're an attorney, you know, and basically, uh... Yeah, you just help people not get the wrongly convicted people of the guilty verdict, you know, so. Yeah, you know, it's not weird, it's not sexualized, it's not violent, you know, it's 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 pretty damn chill for, for an anime game, so. That's what I like about it, honestly. It's, it's chill, it's unique, it's not the usual crap, you know, so. It's pretty good, you know. I'm gonna I'm gonna play the rest of the games down the line, though. You know, you know, pretty emotional, I guess, in their own right. Not crazy emotional, you know. Sure, the music in the game and the bleeping from the characters get really annoying, but the game was on 3DS and it's old, so they just remastered it. But it still plays like the old-fashioned DS games, and um, yeah, it's it's pretty cool. But anyway. Um, and then there was AI, the Somnium Files. That game I played a long time ago. Long, long. It's not even on Game Pass anymore. They made a second one, a second game like three years ago, and I've never played that one. Uh, a little more violent. Uh, a little more than Phoenix Wright, but um, it wasn't still overly thrown. It's ridiculous, though. You know, I guess a little... The eye is a character who's actually a some kind of girl character. I don't know. It, it was a little weird, but I mean, it 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 was still caught my interest. I guess you know to play try it out. I was bored. And Game Pass games, you know, they release a lot of shitty games. But you know, one of the that game was okay. You know, you but it was it, you play as a detective who's hunting a serial killer, and uh, I didn't want to play it over again. I played it once. And I just never really thought of playing it again. You know, it's different timelines, different actions, different story. 
And I don't know, it's not on Game Pass anymore, so I can't really play it. But that Challenger's trunk is open. But yeah, so so yeah, besides those people dying, and that's what I did yesterday. I just went to church, came back, played those games. Saturday, I, I don't really know what I did. I think I, I was just chilling majority of the day. I was tired from going to the shooting range on Friday. Yeah, after work, me and Justin got ready and went shooting on Friday after work. Work was chill. And then, uh, you know, we're not going to Lacey this, um, this week, next week. I let Aunt Jack know we're not going. Uh, only because me and Justin went shooting and I can't really spend anything. Uh, I'm, I mean, I can. I just don't want to owe more on the credit card than I already do. And then, uh... I'm trying to think. Uh, but we had fun. You know, we had fun. I used the camera. I've learned some new little switches and modes on it. So, you know... I got here really quick. It's 9.07. Jesus. Thank God. You know, I got here hella quick. I think it was because of the lights. Oh. Sorry, truck. I didn't realize you had to turn in. I just turned in a little earlier than you did. That's why I always kind of slowly get behind them because I don't want to overlap them. But I think he was just he was just waiting on me to move in so then he can move behind me. So, but yeah, I wasn't trying to overlap them or nothing. That's the thing about turning lanes a little early is you know you gotta kind of not speed up on people and so then you can whomp right into somebody. But anyway, um, yeah, you know, so Char's gone. Now, Char is no longer working at the round one. Good on her. Um, yeah, you know. So, yeah, she signed off on the papers to officially be relieved off of being a mechanic from here. You know, so. I asked her where she was going, and she told me, and I told her I applied to those people, but I didn't hear anything. I'm not really a fixer person, you know, I'm not. I never really was, you know, to, they they do they do garage doors and shit like that, and it's just not me to fuck with garage doors and heavy fixing machinery and cutlery, you know, I don't want to cut my finger off, you know, but I applaud anybody who does do that kind of line of work. You know, so, but, yeah, so, with that being said, um, um, yeah, you know, Michael's gonna end up getting talked to, the co-worker, Michael, uh, I caught him in the women's bathroom. And, you know, I noticed things were different in the women's bathroom. Like, somebody changed the sandy packs. Like, I, I've mentioned this in an earlier video last week. And I was like, what the fuck? Who did this? You know? He just pulled the sandy packs out. And he didn't even bother um, putting new ones in. So I asked the Greg. I was like, who the fuck did this? You know? And that's when I found out that uh, Greg, or not Greg, Michael signed off from the women's bathroom at 6 o'clock. So, yeah, the boy just does not get it. Seems to be only four or five, six people here this morning. Huh. <sighs> Justin's got six hours, seven hours. I got uh, seven and a half hours ish, eight hours. Yeah, no Char, no Shari Char. Her Subaru's gone. So, so yeah, you know. 
But anyway, uh, oh, shit. Now I got two bags of cereal, I guess. And I brought some pizza as well. Yeah, so. Yeah, I'm hoping for the day I find something that I can enjoy for a next job and decent hours at the very least and decent days. But, um. But only time shall tell, like I say. It is Monday after all. Just need to really, um. Knock today out of the water, you know. Just knock this week out of the water, you know. Uh, and then. Yeah. No. But mainly right now I need to focus on getting through today. So. I'm going to head in now. Y'all have a good one. Hope this week works out for all of you. Some people are off. It's their Sunday right now. But Sunday. My Sunday. So. Yep. Till the next video. Uh, it's fucking cloudy out here. It's so weird. At this time of year. Oh yeah, I got a dentist appointment next Tuesday as well. Next week I got a dentist appointment. On July 22nd. So. I don't know what time it'll be though. I gotta look. But anyway. Bye for now. Ugh. <sighs>